how's everybody doing say thanks for joining me i got this crazy i'm about to blow y'all minds guys watch this right by the boat let me do a shark cast nope not right here way over here almost off the map in the shallow like four to five inch water there's a spot check this out guys watch boom boom look at that look at all those fish so I am fishing in Sabine River today, and I've been searching for more hot spots to share with you guys, but I found this. I mean, look at that. That is just incredible. So this is one spot, and I'll show you exactly how to get there. So you cannot get to the water that's behind this spot. And if you cast past the cypress trees and the cypress knees, it'll just be like a shallow one-inch pool. But then all of a sudden, boom, there's a big old large spot where the fish are just stuck. Now this was not a one-time occurrence. I actually quit the game, restarted my Xbox, loaded back in, and went to the same spot. And guess what? They were still there. Three times I went to it, and three times they were there. Trophy bass, big old catfish, 30 pound garfish. I mean, they were stacked up with white bass. I caught white bass, white bass and Sabine get big. They got six pound plus white bass over here in Sabine. So drop a comment below. Let me know what you guys have been catching. Any legendary fish caught in Sabine River? Look, stay tuned to end of the video. I got some news for you. I'm putting together a hotspot video that's going to be multiple parts because Sabine River has so much fish. There's hotspots all over the map. There's no way I can include it in one video. So I'm going to do it section by section. But check out the big old catfish I got at the end of this video. So this was just non-stop action. I did have the boat a little further away, making some long casts past the hot spot, pulling it closer into the spot, into the strike zone. It was just fish after fish, but I eventually pulled the boat closer, just got some shark casts going out there, just pitching that jinkalistic swim bait right on top of them. It's so shallow right here. I mean, it's got to be less than a foot deep, four or five inches way past that. I don't know how some of these fish get in there. I mean, I caught a 60 something pound catfish in four inches of water. How did he fit back there? Because he was like in the mud, stuck down there, hibernating for the winter. I don't know, but he was there and there was a bunch of fish. Yes. Now, like I said, they got some big white bass. I mean, if white bass were included in the Bassmaster Tournament, I could definitely win a tournament just with white bass on Sabine River. Let's take a look at a little more action, then I'll show you a quick boat ride, how to get to this spot. I did catch a bunch of trophy bass. Now, remember, Trophy bass in Sabine River only running 6-7 pounds, so anything more than 8 is going to be a legendary largemouth bass. So some 6-7 and seven pound largemouth bass in Sabine River will win a tournament for you. Yes! Oh boy, that is Shack Daddy Super Bass. All right, let's go ahead and take a boat ride. I'll show you exactly how to get to that spot. So just head out, go left when you leave the starting area. It is early in the morning. The sun's right in my face, so it's a little hard to find. But I'm going to go almost all the way to the back by the buoys. If you look over to the left, you'll see some houses, some buildings. They got buildings. There's a loading dock right there. So directly across from the loading dock, on the other side of the bank, you'll see a spot where the water goes back. There's like a flooded pond back there that you can't get to.
So drive along the bank until you see the area where the, you can see the water just kind of runs through into the back to that flooded pond back there. That's the spot I want to go duck hunting right there. Back in that flooded pond. So right there where all the cypress knees are, right on this little point right here. That's where you want to be. So just pull in there, make a few casts. Hopefully you'll find the hot spot. If you fish this spot, make sure to come back to the video, drop a comment, and let me know what you caught. So the water is half a foot deep and look at all those fish look at that man they're just stacked up in there i love when they jump out the water like that so let's catch a couple more fish i'll show you a nice catfish that i caught right here from the little four or five inch foot spot so i can't believe this big old 60 something pound catfish was back there but wait there's more i got my pb flathead catfish and i'm about to show you Sixty four pounds 13 ounce not a bad catfish for sabine river they get way bigger so check out this beast from beneath that is a big flathead. So I saw him fishing, switched over to one of my favorite catfish lures. So I will show you the lure, the rod and reel combination that I use to catch catfish. But check out this big old boy. This was, oh my God, got a heartbeat going on. The 50 pound braid makes a difference fighting these big fish. So if you haven't tried it yet, you got to get you some 50 pound line on that rod and reel combo. So let's get this big old boy in the boat. My PB flathead in Sabine River. So I went back and I checked and I'm pretty sure this is my largest flathead that I've caught in so far. Now that's a beast right there. That is a monster. So I don't know about you guys, but I really hope Bassmasters Fishing 2022 actually implements legendary fish that are non-bass. So why do they have legendary weight included in the catfish and garfish and striped bass and tigers if they don't have them legendary fish in the game? So why even show us the weight requirements? Put some fish in there that'll gonna be legendary catfish because I will make some videos on blue catfish and flathead catfish on every fish in the game. But this is Bassmaster Fishing, so all the gear, rod and reel setups are meant to catch bass. But maybe we can hope, we can dream, we can wish, we can make some posts on Twitter, let them know what you want. I think he's getting tired. He's starting to slow down now. So I got the drag set up to 38. So I'm gonna pull this big old boy in. That is a whale. That is a beast. 81 pounds, 11 ounces, 60 inches long. So man, that is a beast. The gill, natural dark blue gill. That's one of my favorite lures to use to catch catfish. 9,400 bass bucks, man. That should buy me some gear. So take a look at my rod and reel combo. I'll show you what I use to catch this big old catfish. So 50 pound braid, Texas rig, quarter ounce, five odd hook. So I use a rod and reel combo made by favorite. The favorite white bird spinning and the favorite white bird spinning reel. Well, thanks for watching, guys. As always, keep fishing, stay happy, and I'll see you next time.